here we have a wheelchair athlete who has already learned the basic how to get a stance position how to hold a wheelchair how to hold a racket and also a shuttlecock here is the time when the athlete should start learning how to execute a stroke and a coach has to start his speeding to improve the athlete here since my athlete is a beginner so i would like to feed only one stroke and put my full attention towards the athlete that how he is executing the stroke whether is action his grip his basic stance position and his elbow position is as per technical correct rules or not here the athlete is in a standing position and just concentrating on the execution of drops once the coach observes that the athlete is learning and his strokes are technically correct the coach can start a double feed a two times feed to the athlete to let him more familiar of the strokes and once the coach realizes that athlete is doing good even executing two strokes together the coach can start with three strokes four strokes five feeds six feeds and even a rally like this while feeding the shuttlecock to any of the wheelchair athlete the coach should make variation in the height and even in the speed of shuttlecock however since the athlete is a beginner so he may not allow the athlete to make movements at that time but once the coach realizes that the athlete is now good enough to execute a standing stroke the coach can start the drill with front and back movements this way here the athlete is now good enough to even execute a rally stroke and this is the time that the coach can use different style of feeding the shuttlecocks to improve his speed his reflection his agility and even fast wheelchair movements
feet under arm.